How's it going everyone? Mitch here with another tips and tricks video. I believe this is number seven and today I'm going to be talking about how to fatten up those vocals, how to make those vocals pop in your song. All right, so as you can see here, I just slapped this audio track right on top of this channel strip and this channel strip has no plugins, no auxiliary bus tracks, nothing. All right, so let's take a listen to it, see what it sounds like beforehand. Boy, you're an alien. So a little bit dry, a little bit meh, meh, meh. So what we're going to do is do one of the many techniques um, to fatten up your vocals. Uh, there's so many different things you can do out there, um, but I'm just going to be showing you this one today. All right. First thing you want to do is put your output to bus one. All right. And as you can see, it will create this auxiliary track for us here. But what we want to do is to create a second auxiliary strip, uh, auxiliary channel strip, sorry, and have our input be again bus one. All right, so we have auxiliary one and auxiliary two. Both have inputs of that Vox track. And what we're going to do is we're going to add a single plugin, and it's going to be the pitch shifter two, all right? And what I'm going to do is I don't want to actually pitch shift this voice, so I'm going to turn semi -tone tones down to zero. And then I'm going to turn the mix up to 30%. And make sure your scents are at positive 10. All right. Now, if you hold down Command Option, click that pitch shift and drag it over to Auxiliary Channel Strip 2. Double click that second or pitch shift plugin you just copied and kick it down to negative 10. All right. Now, this Vox track is going to be feeding both this first and second auxiliary channel strip. And these both are going to be playing at the same time, so they're going to be louder than a single track. So I'm going to lower their volumes just a little bit. And now let's see what happens when um, we play this track back. Your touch so foreign, it's supernatural, ex-boy, you're an alien. So you can definitely tell there's almost a doubling effect that goes on there. It kicks up the, um, the intensity of that, of the vocal track just a little bit more. It makes it pop a little bit more, and that's exactly what we're going for. All right, so let's go back and listen to just normal. Boy, you're an alien. Now let's listen to what we just created. Boy, you're an alien. Your touch so foreign. All right, and there you are, everyone. That's all I had to show you today is just that doubling, fattening effect that you can get with the pitch shifter plugin inside of Logic Pro 9. All right, so if you have any suggestions on future videos, be sure to hit me up in the comments below or in a message. And um, I will hopefully make a video out of that. And then um, please comment, rate, subscribe. And I will be seeing you very soon. Peace out.